What kind of business are you in? We predict the future. The best way to predict the future is to invent it. Then they dumped his body in the ocean before telling anyone about it. Have you ever stood and stared at it? Marveled at its beauty? Its genius? Billions of people just living out their lives. This is about nuclear weapon going off in Manhattan. Yeah! <laughs> this camera was capable of making 15 million pictures a second. 15 million pictures yeah, per second. Wow, we had some advanced uh, technology. And we've got bombage. Nowadays, they want you to believe that satellites can fit in the palm of your hand. Now they have CubeSat satellites, and they can de <laughs> they can be deployed from the International Space Station by hand. An astronaut can toss one of these CubeSat satellites at the Earth. Doesn't even matter how he throws it at the Earth. You could don't believe. Everything you see, don't believe Everything you read, we're living in the age of the hoax Oh, we're living in the age of the hoax Er ist nicht in der Bunkeranlage Was soll das heißen? Sie können Fägeler nicht finden Hombre humano, porque hay, hay seres humanos que no Tienen forma humana, pero no son, yo soy un humano That led to Chris Wood's death The fuck is that? I don't have my ID, so I couldn't, or my ticket or anything, but I just told them. <laughs> yeah. Your cattle, your goyim, the human cattle, Mazel tov. I do care what you do with this information because it is important to our survival as a species. It's important for assassinating American citizens without charges. We should think very seriously about this. Ah. Uh... So in love. I performed fellatio on Senator Obama in the limousine during the time Senator Obama was smoking crack cocaine. I inhaled. We predict the future. The best way to predict the future is to invent it. And come out of nowhere and... Just scream right into the side of the Twin Tower, exploding through the other side. Just a few blocks away and witnessed... Dude, I was, I was, I live on the 43rd floor of a building which is five blocks from the World Trade Center itself. I witnessed the entire thing from beginning to end. The opportunity to pledge your allegiance to the Prince. I am Osama. It's gonna be alright, it's gonna be alright. You ain't heard, nigga! Good. It ain't right. You were lying to us here tonight. The hooks is rolling. Another drill is gone live. Gone live. Gone live. Gone live. Gone live. All the false flags. My ass is tender. I thought I never ever will surrender. Till the day that you're all behind bars. It's all coming down! This is control demolition. Zeker weten, zeker weten. Er is nagesprongen. Dit is in opdracht gebeurd. Het heeft een team gedaan van experts. Get behind me, Satan. And a fraud. They all want to obtain with a false light of black sunshine. That godlike power. The accuser. The Get this behind me, Satan. Leash. I'm a Scientologist. Oh! Oh! They're dead. They're all dead. Is this another false flag state attack to take our civil liberties and put more homeland security? I was thinking of hands on. 
good thing it's not being prosecution because then I couldn't answer that. You know Michelle is a tramp. It was a grown man. A grown man, yeah. And everybody knows it. I, 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 I mean, Michael and I... Can't even fly. <laughs> he can't believe it. I didn't want to believe it. I couldn't believe it. I couldn't accept it. Get ready. So you done yet. How does this... I mean, look, people. What we need to do is change the way in which people think about guns. And just really brainwash. Dedicated. This is, you know, it's rough and tumble. And it's wild and wooly, and it's blast. Not the law of the jungle. What the fuck are you talking? Blast. It's, it's part of our constitution. You know, the right to bear arms is because that's the last form of defense against tyranny. World War III is coming. I am Osama. I am Osama. It's gonna be all right. It's gonna be all right. It's uh, very, very unusual. The three victims were part of a CXS. Fuck it right in the pussy. I'm not advocating that. Tonight, I can report to the American people and to the world that the United States has conducted an operation that killed Osama bin Laden, the leader of Al-Qaeda, and a terrorist who's responsible for the murder of thousands of innocent men, women, and children. Then they dumped his body in the ocean before telling anyone about it. That was water. Of course, there's cutting. It's extremely messy. Are you people insane? Just shut down. What are you talking about? What 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 you talking about? After a deluded gunman assassinated President Kennedy. Now we're the best two people that's there. He gets up, he reads. I'm thinking, fuck, I'm not gonna get this. Then I get up, I'm reading. I shock myself. We both sit down. He said, I fucking love both of you guys. Both of you guys are talented. But which one of you guys are gonna suck my cock? Oh! Turn up. Nigga. Turn up, radio. Right you nigga. Turn down. How bad you listen, want it, nigga? Turn listen, down. listen. <laughs> I bust out laughing because I know motherfucker ain't never talked to me like that before. I'm like, what? Right, right, right. And what fucked me up was the other dude, who I ain't gonna say their name. Right. He wasn't laughing. He was like, oh, that's all? That's all I gotta do? <laughs> I, and I looked at him, I'm like, right. oh, it went hell down. no. And to keep it real, <laughs> he got the lead role, baby boy. All right. Uh, hopes me gently, hopes me slowly, take it easy, don't you know? Michael and I. No, I can fuck the flame and fuck it all. I'm the head of the motherfucking state, nigga. Thank you. Bringing change, nigga. What the fuck you thinking, nigga? Obama then smoked the crack cocaine. I performed fellatio on Senator Obama. As I mentioned before, uh, exposure to true information does not matter anymore. A person who was demoralized is unable to assess true information. The facts tell nothing to him. Uh, even if I shower him with information, with, with authentic proof, with documents, with pictures, even if I take him by force to the Soviet Union and show him concentration camp, he will refuse to believe it until he, he is going to receive a kick in, the, in his fat bottom. Radiation. We love radiation. What kind of business are you in? So what's wrong with the population? I mean, we're too many people. That's what. That's why we have global warming. We have global warming because too many people are using too much stuff. But if there were less people, they'd be using less but stuff. It, it's freedom when we do. We don't spy on anybody. We don't lie either. KVOA News 4 are very committed, so committed. I'm going to sign off now because I want to get there by the time everything tips off. So I'm going to hand the microphone over to my buddy Danny here and go Wildcats. All right, hey, Paul, get you inside. Enjoy that game. We'll see you back here at 10 o'clock. Thanks so much.
President Obama. People can be led to believe something that is not true when that information is carefully timed and presented by an accepted and respected authority. The purpose of propaganda is to. With highlights and backstage coverage, we're seeing for the very first time. Sari. Well, a very, very heavy, uh, heavy divertation tonight. We had a very Darrison by Let's go to Terrace Terry's in those for the bit. They had this. Very poor choice of words. <laughs> but if you take guns away from all of us legal gun owners, then the only people that will have guns will be the bad guys. In fact, I'm curious. I want to see a show of hands right now. All those for gun control, raise your hands. All right, there's one, two, three, four. Anyone else? Ah, see there, that figures. All the usual suspects. Any questions? I actually uh, got into Scientology for a while, and uh, that's how I got this nice glazed look in my eye. Uh, we have before us the opportunity to forge for ourselves and for future generations a new world order. A world where the rule of law, not the law of the jungle, governs the conduct of nations. After a deluded gunman assassinated President Kennedy. When we are successful, and we will be. When we are successful, and we will be. We have a real chance at this new world order. An order in which a credible United Nations can use its peacekeeping role to fulfill the promise and vision of the UN's founders. In these troubled times, our fifth objective, a new world order can emerge, a new era, freer from the threat of terror, and today that new world is struggling to be born. A world quite different from the one we've known, a world where the rule of law supplants the rule of the jungle. What is at stake is more than one small country. It is a big idea, a new world order. Yes, get. Boys and girls, sound this word out. Get ready. Steel. What word? Steel. Yes, steel. Read these words the fast way. Get ready. Play. play. Yes, play. Satan is making plans to rule the world. Kind of like pinky in the brain, you know. God's up in heaven laughing about it. And the rest of us will be cannibals. Civilization will have broken down. What The few people who are left will be living in a, in, in a failed state like Somalia or Sudan. And, and living conditions will be intolerable. The droughts will be so bad there'll be no more corn growing. It, it will... The, but not doing it is suicide. Just like dropping bombs on each other, nuclear weapons is suicide. So we've got to stop doing the two suicidal things, which are nuclear hanging and, on to our and, nuclear and, weapons. And, and the left hand now knows what the right hand is doing. Everyone's going to have to chip in. That's only fair. And in recent weeks, Americans have seen those emotions on display. On the streets of major cities, Mississippi may end up being the most tragic loss of all. George Bush doesn't care about black people. I'm talking about. I'm a Scientologist.
effect immediately to release a high concentration of cloud seeding material into the fringes of the storm. We mourn seven heroes. Michael Smith, Dick Scobie, Judith Resnick, Ronald McNair, Ellison Onizuka, Gregory Jarvis, and Krista Mikulov. On board was a crew of seven. Colonel Rick Husband, Lieutenant Colonel Michael Anderson, Commander Laurel Clark, Captain David Brown, Commander William McCool, Dr. Kultna Shapla, and Elon Ramon. And perhaps we've forgotten the courage it took. Because <laughs> I'm the guy can't even fly. <laughs> I can fly. It's one small step for man. Heck of a big leap for me. Astronaut Bruce McCandless maneuvered 300 effortless feet away from the shuttle in his manned maneuvering unit. This new tool provides us with a means of extending man's physical presence outside. The more in space we are, our atmospheric density decreases exponentially. There's this video here I've seen several times. And the duct tape comes flying into one of the guy's faces. The zero-g plane is done doing his parabolic trajectory. Exponentially as we leave the Earth. This is why we need oxygen tanks to climb Mount Everest. The further we get from the surface of Earth, the less atmosphere there is, and the closer to space we are. You to Stop. Laboratory home. This is Space Station Freedom, where international teams of astronauts will live and work permanently in space. <laughs> Eight crew members can live comfortably aboard Freedom. The astronauts' private quarters are equipped with computers, VCRs, and telecommunications to Earth. Each astronaut lives on freedom for three to six months at a time. The habitation module has bathroom and shower facilities, health maintenance center, and a fully equipped galley with all the conveniences of home. Except here, there is no gravity. <laughs> we need a point where the atmosphere becomes unusable and we can say that we're in space. I can, I can eat planets. And this is the Karman line. At the Karman line, we can't use the atmosphere to make airplanes work. At this line, about 100 kilometers above sea level, there is not enough atmospheric density to distinguish between winged flight and a rocket escaping the Earth. I hope you've learned something about where space begins and the Earth's atmosphere ends and can see where science is in everything. <laughs> there should be thousands of... Look at this satellite. There should be thousands of pictures of Earth from space by now because satellites are old technology. And you can't even find real pictures of the Earth because real pictures of the Earth don't exist. Whole article is bullshit. NASA is bullshit. SpaceX.
like thinking about money. But yeah, we, we lost the fucking joy, job. Joy. I'm getting paid maybe a hundred bucks an hour just to stand here and pretend I'm crying. But I better have a bit of a laugh. Notice the stuff oh, on his lapel God, there. This whole what thing here on television. It? it just shows you how bad this is. Look at this. Robbie Parker's dad. What's the kid looking at? Why should he straight ahead? responsible for the air current. Here the editor cuts to a still shot of the flag just as the effect becomes noticeable. Here it is unchecked. This rare clip, attained decades ago, was never re-released with the inevitable increase in